Great day, beautiful people. Sammy Farage here. I guarantee you that you worry about what people think of you, right? You worry about people's opinions of you. And I'm going to share with you how to break out of that and why you shouldn't care about people's opinions of you, okay? Whatever area of your life, it may be in the workplace, it may be in going to the gym, going in public, the way you look, different areas of your life, you worry about what people think of you. And that's okay because I worry about what people think of me too. So, to break out of that is one, I'm going to give you quick reality checks. One, people's opinions will never pay your bills, okay? So there, you should not worry about what people think of you. It's obviously easier said than done because I personally struggled with this too. But you want to slowly tackle away at this, uh, this thing, this mental imprisonment, these self-limiting beliefs that we create for ourselves up here that we should break out of. Because at the end of the day, you're going to die. I'm going to die. That's just the reality of this existence, okay? So you worrying about what people think, you got to be able to break out of that slowly, all right? I've been posting content for a very long time, and I can speak on myself, so I'm going to share this with you guys. I've been posting content for a very long time, right? I still worry about what people think of me in different areas of my life, the way I express myself. There's certain things I don't express or don't show or don't do because I worry about what people think of me. But at the end of the day, that doesn't matter because once again, people's opinions will never pay your bills. You shouldn't worry about what people think of you, but it's a process. Everything is a process. Trust the process. Like I've said a million times, trust the process. What you need to do is literally tackle away at this every single day and be conscious of what causes you to think about other people thinking about you. Now listen to this quote I heard a very long time ago, a couple years ago. Um, I'm not who I think I am. I'm not what you think I am. I'm what I think you think I am. So what we do a lot of times is we think for other people. So for example, when it comes to social or social media, when it comes to social media, when we post a post, whether it's posting a story, whether it's making a post, a video, uh, we think before we click post, we are thinking about, oh, this person's gonna see it, this person's gonna see it. What are they gonna think? Are they gonna say something? And sometimes we don't post because we thought for someone else of what they may think about us or what they might say about us, right? Now I'm at a point where I don't care. I'm going to post it regardless, right? When you think, when that thought comes in your mind about what someone else's opinion of you may be, post it, say it, do it, go out in public. Who cares how you look, right? I go in public confidently in myself regardless of how I look because I know who I am inside. A shirt is not going to define who I am. The car that I drive is not going to define who I am, right? What I got on does not define who I am because I know who I am. I'm confident in my own skin, okay? When I was hurt walking like an 89-year-old man, I was still confident in my skin because I know who I am. I'm Sammy Farage. And you should be confident in your own skin because you are you. Nobody else is you. You are one of a kind, right? Don't be somebody else. So, what do you need to do to overcome what people think of you? How do you break out of that? Slowly tackle away at the things that cause you to worry about what people think of you. Like I said, the example about posting on social media, right? Speaking on camera, a lot of people are afraid to speak on camera. They may be confident speaking in person, but they're afraid to speak on camera. Why? Because they're probably worrying about what people think. They feel awkward. Who cares? Just do it, right? Slowly do the things that cause you to become uncomfortable and you become comfortable with it, right? Simple. Easier said than done, of course, but it's a process. So this is just a reminder to you. This video that I just wanted to just shoot, not script or anything, I just wanted to get on here and just talk to you guys, is just do the things that make you uncomfortable that cause you to worry about what people think of you. Okay, it's pretty straightforward. Don't worry about what people think of you. Like I said, they're not going to pay your bills. Life, we don't know our existence here and how long we'll be on this earth. So with that being said, do it. Do it. Create a, create a legacy for yourself. Document your life on social media. So one day my kids, my grand, my great grandkids can go on social media and be like, man, that was my grandfather. Look, look, man, this dude did videos. Document your life. Like we have the privilege, we have the access to document our lives on social media, right? Post YouTube videos, post Instagram videos, Snapchat, whatever the case may be. You can document your life on this platform or create whatever your heart desires on this, these platforms, but have a direction, have a purpose, have a reason why you do what you do. And don't worry about people's opinions, okay? Because at the end of the day, people's opinions don't pay your bills. Remember that. Remember that. Every time someone's, that thought comes in your mind, remember, hey, they ain't, ain't going to pay my bills, so let me do it, right? Who cares? Who cares? Who cares? It's easier said than done, but be conscious of it. Conscious talks. This is why 
this is a new series here, all right? So I'm getting to the end. My thought process is running out. So I'm gonna wrap it up right here. If you continue to watch once again, drop a comment, show this video some love. I hope you got one gem out of this video. Like I said, I can I could have cut this video right here. Prime example right here. I could have cut this video right now and been like, man, I, 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 I low-key fucked up at the end. I don't wanna post it because I probably look stupid. I rambled on, uh, but I'm gonna still post it because at the end of the day, your opinion, or if you're gonna say something about what I just posted, that's just a reflection of you, all right? And always remember that when someone projects their insecurities onto you, it's just a reflection of them. So don't take it personal. That's one thing you have to remember. Never take other people's opinions personal. And I'm gonna wrap that, I'm gonna wrap it up with that. So never take anything personal. Continue to do you. Be confident in your own skin because there's only one you. I appreciate you. Peace.